Playoff predictions can go any way. That's what makes it so exciting, because anything can happen. It's hard for me to imagine a Mike Tomlin team going out soft in Big Ben's last game. There are a whopping seven new playoff teams who didn't qualify a year ago. And unlike past years, the 2022 postseason is wide open with no clear-cut favorite, especially in the AFC. Without further ado, we present to you our predictions for how the entire NFL postseason will play out. Wild Card Weekend, AFC. Two Kansas City Chiefs versus seven Pittsburgh Steelers. The defending AFC champions throttled the Steelers 36 to 10 at Arrowhead in week 16. Honestly, you gotta expect more of the same this time around. Ben Roethlisberger is super thankful for one last postseason run in his swan song year, but he has very little arm strength left. And the overly frequent check down passes aren't gonna fool Steve Spagnolo's defense. This Pittsburgh D can absolutely keep the high powered KC offense in check. TJ Watt, Alex Highsmith, Cameron Hayward, and Minka Fitzpatrick will always give the Steelers a chance. But Mahomes has lit up the Steelers in the two games he's played them. And again, this isn't an in his prime Roethlisberger. The Hall of Famer's career ends at Arrowhead. Prediction Chiefs 27, Steelers 16. Wild card weekend. AFC. Three Buffalo Bills vs. Six New England Patriots. The two bitter AFC East rivals split the season series, with the road team claiming a victory in December on both occasions. Yes, Josh Allen has often struggled against a Bill Belichick coach defense. Then again, which quarterbacks haven't? But Buffalo gets a full house for this home showdown, and they had the NFL's best scoring and overall defense. And they're on a roll with four straight wins, while the Pats have slumped with losses in three of their last four. This should be an epic chess match between Belichick and Sean McDermott, but Buffalo has the better quarterback, the better defense, and Bills Mafia behind them. Prediction, Bills 23, Patriots 20. Wild Card Weekend, AFC. Four Cincinnati Bengals versus five Las Vegas Raiders. Fun fact, the Bengals last won a playoff game in the 1990 Wild Card Round. They were eliminated by the Raiders one week later. Little did the Bengals know at the time that they would proceed to go 31 years and counting without a playoff win. The Raiders were a wonderful feel-good story, reeling off four straight wins, including a Week 18 overtime thriller against the Los Angeles Chargers to end a five-year postseason drought. But the Bengals crushed this team in Sin City back in Week 11, and now they're at home. And the Raiders don't have anybody to contain Jamar Chase, T. Higgins, Joe Mixon, and Tyler Boyd. On the flip side, since he's prolific front seven, led by Trey Hendrickson, should be able to wreak havoc on the Raiders' leaky O-line since he finally gets that elusive playoff victory. Predictions, Bengals 31, Raiders 20. Wild Card Weekend, NFC. Two Tampa Bay Buccaneers versus seven Philadelphia Eagles. Philly closed out this season on a 6-2 and two run to qualify for the NFC's final playoff spot. But as you've probably heard by now, they didn't beat a single playoff team this season. One of their eight losses included a close 28-22 defeat at home with the Bucks back in week six. Of course, Philly was still finding its groove under rookie head coach Nick Sirianni. And the Buccaneers still had Antonio Brown and Chris Godwin. Philly boasted the NFL's top rushing offense this season. And Tampa's run D frequently struggled in the second half. Darius Lee is one of the few corners who can make life tough for Mike Evans as well. But how can you bet against Tom Brady at home? In the postseason, the Buccaneers are the defending champions for a reason. They're built for games like this. We wouldn't be shocked if Philly pulled off the upset. But the Bucs have the advantage where it matters most, at quarterback. The defending champs will survive at least one more week. Prediction, Buccaneers 27, Eagles 20. Wild Card Weekend, NFC. Three Dallas Cowboys versus six San Francisco 49ers. The Cowboys and 49ers will meet in the postseason for the first time since the 94 NFC Championship game. You know, when the 49ers thwarted the Cowboys bid for a three-peat at Candlestick Park. This game on paper is the most exciting of the six wildcard matchups. Dallas features an explosive offense led by Dak Prescott, a two-headed monster in the backfield featuring Ezekiel Elliott and Tony Pollard, and the elite receiving duo of Amari Cooper and C.D. Lamb. And of course, the defense enjoyed a major renaissance under new DC Dan Quinn, thanks to the rise of two young phenoms in Micah Parsons and Trayvon Diggs. The 49ers, like the Cowboys, feature a ton of weaponry on both sides of the ball. Jimmy Garoppolo, Elijah Mitchell, George Kittle, Debo Samuel, and Brandon Ayuk can totally keep pace with Dallas offense. Meanwhile, Nick Bosa and Fred Warner taking on a star-studded Cowboys O-line will be must-watch TV. But Dallas has the always important home field advantage. And unlike Prescott, Jimmy G is still 
prone to the costly turnovers. Furthermore, we don't think the 49ers have the defensive backs who are capable of slowing down Dallas aerial attack. It should be a thriller, but America's team will prevail. Prediction Cowboys 23, 49ers 19. Wild Card Weekend, NFC. Four Los Angeles Rams versus five Arizona Cardinals. An NFC West showdown featuring two teams loaded with star power, as well as potent passing games and young, innovative, offensive-minded head coaches. Should be fun. Here's another interesting storyline to watch. Though they both have championship aspirations heading into the postseason, but the Rams and Cardinals slumped over the final stretch. Matthew Stafford had seven picks over his final three games, while Arizona dropped four of their final five contests. Something's got to give here. Which quarterback will bounce back after a rough final stretch? Which defense will right the ship? and come up with some big plays. These are the questions that need to be answered on Monday night. This is a practical coin flip, but the Rams have been a little bit more competitive over the last few weeks. As long as Stafford doesn't commit so many costly turnovers this time, the likes of Cooper Cup, Odell Beckham Jr., Aaron Donald, and Jalen Ramsey should help the Rams get the win at home. Arizona isn't quite ready for prime time. Prediction Rams 31, Cardinals 27. Divisional round, AFC. One Tennessee Titans versus four Cincinnati Bengals. If our calculations are correct, the AFC's top seed will draw Joe Burrow's Bengals in the divisional round. The Titans will likely have Derrick Henry back for this one. A showdown of Henry versus Joe Mixon sounds appetizing on paper, but keep this in mind. The Bengals had the number five rush D while ranking a mere 26th against the pass. And it's a similar story with the Titans. They were second against the run, but 25th against the pass. This could very well come down to Tannehill versus Joe Burrow. Burrow was by far the better QB this season, but the more battle-tested and experienced Titans have a clear advantage here. This is their third straight year in the playoffs, and this would mark Burrow's first time playing in a hostile environment in the NFL postseason. Experience is always key, and the Bengals don't have it just yet. Prediction Titans 24, Bengals 17. Divisional round, AFC. Two Kansas City Chiefs versus three Buffalo Bills. This will be a rematch of last year's AFC Championship game, and the two teams also played in Week 5 where the Bills emerged with a blowout victory in Arrowhead. KC will be looking to reach its fourth straight AFC title game. The Bills, on the other hand, will be looking to reach their second straight conference championship. So who will keep their streak alive? This year's Chiefs were vulnerable against the pass, and their offense isn't as scary compared to the 2018, 2019, and 2020 versions. Also, this is the best defense Buffalo has fielded yet against Patrick Mahomes. You'll almost never have us picking against the Chiefs, especially on their own turf. But the 2021 Bills match up oh so well with KC, even without Tredavious White. Buffalo pulls off the upset, setting up a trip to the Music City. Prediction, Bills 31, Chiefs 24. Divisional round, NFC. One Green Bay Packers versus four Los Angeles Rams. This would mark the second straight NFC divisional round showdown between the Packers and Rams. On paper, Donald and Ramsey should be able to destroy A-Rod in the prolific Green Bay offense, right? Not exactly. In last year's playoff game and during their week 12 meeting this season, Rodgers totaled 603 passing yards and five touchdowns with no picks. And he was sacked just once. Meanwhile, Matthew Stafford hasn't exactly had the greatest success against the Packers. And again, his sloppy play in recent weeks will be a big cause for concern. Cooper Cup had a historic season, but a healthy Jair Alexander should limit his production. It all adds up to another Green Bay win over Los Angeles. Prediction, Packers 35, Rams 21. Divisional round, NFC. Two Tampa Bay Buccaneers versus three Dallas Cowboys. A cowboys Bucks showdown would mark a rematch for their thrilling week one kickoff game, which Tampa won 31-29 on a last second Ryan suck up field goal. Brady and Prescott combined for 782 passing yards and seven touchdowns in that game. Only one sack was allowed all game. A lot has changed since then. The Bucks again don't have Brown or Godwin. There are two leading receivers from that game. The Dallas rushing game should be better this time around, and their new look defense was a work in progress at the time. Micah Parsons will be even better in this matchup. Trayvon Diggs should be able to limit Mike Evans the way he did in their week one meeting. Dallas opportunistic defense can totally force some much needed turnovers, and Dak should be able to pick apart this Tampa secondary again. Prediction Cowboys 34, Buccaneers 26. AFC Championship. One Tennessee Titans versus three Buffalo Bills. For the first time since the Music City Miracle game 22 years ago, the Bills and Titans will meet in the postseason, according to our projections. Here it is, two franchises with no Super Bowls, both looking to end conference title droughts of over two decades. 
Grab your popcorn. The Titans defeated Buffalo here at home in the 2020 and 2021 regular seasons, putting up a combined 76 points over those two contests. But the Bills should be better prepared this time around. Again, they only had the NFL's top-ranked defense in the regular season. And Ryan Tannehill's shaky play is something that the Buffalo secondary can take advantage of in potential rematch. Furthermore, the Titans' weak pass defense will struggle to match up with Buffalo's deep group of pass catchers. A McDermott coach Buffalo team, led by Josh Allen and a lockdown defense, is too talented to get run over by the Titans for a third time in two seasons. Prediction Bills 26, Titans 17. NFC Championship. One Green Bay Packers versus three Dallas Cowboys. This would be the third playoff meeting between these historic rivals in eight seasons. Green Bay came out victorious on both occasions in the 2014 and 2016 NFC Divisional rounds. This time, it's for all the marbles in the NFC. Dallas has the pieces on both sides to keep this game very close, no doubt. But here's the thing. The star-studded Packers team is due for some luck in the conference championship game. They just can't keep dropping heartbreakers forever, right? Green Bay has too much firepower on offense for the likes of Diggs and Parsons to contain. Now on the other side of the ball, the Packers defense is well equipped to handle Dallas' strong set of weapons, especially with a healthy Jair Alexander returning to the lineup. Dallas will give it their all, but Rodgers makes his long away to return to the Super Bowl 11 years later. Prediction Packers 28, Cowboys 17. Super Bowl 56, one Green Bay Packers versus three Buffalo Bills. I would love to see this matchup. No shortage of intriguing potential storylines here. Is this the last dance for Rodgers in Green Bay? Even if it's not, this could be his very last Super Bowl appearance for all we know. Meanwhile, can the Bills finally end over a half century of Buffalo sports misery? Do they finally heal the millions of broken hearts that endured four straight Super Bowl losses in the 90s? Rodgers, Devontae Adams, and Aaron Jones against the NFL's top defense. What a chess match this would be. This game could certainly go down as a classic. The best QB right now versus one of the best young quarterbacks of the next generation. But unfortunately for Bills fans, the heartbreak will continue thanks to another signature Aaron Rodgers performance. Prediction, Packers 27, Bills 23. Who do you think will win Super Bowl 56? Join me in the comment section below. Make sure to follow myself and TPS on social media. We post great content all the time. Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, YouTube, we're on everything. Go subscribe, go follow. If you like this video, give it a like. It takes one click down below and subscribe to TPS. We post videos every single day. Every day is a new video. Of course, thank you so much for watching. I'm Jason Biondo. I'll see you next time. On my knee.